Sass Gang. I hope you all are doing wonderful today. My name is Monty. So I'm going to be hopping right into our interviews. I want you all to take one seat. We would do not. If anything does resonate with you, hit that like button, comment, and subscribe to the channel. Stop rolling if needed. Also, Sass Gang, thank you, thank you, thank you for the love, likes, comments. Thank you for the support. Thank y'all for everything that y'all do to help the channel grow. I really love and appreciate you guys. So sad. Check out my new flower bouquet from Rose Forever. You know, you got Mother's Day coming up. Definitely check out the website. That website will be down in the, the website link will be down in the description box below. Uh, these flowers are set to last for a year. They smear very great. You can get any bouquet, any size, any colors. I would definitely, definitely, definitely encourage you all to check out the website, okay? Don't miss out. All right, so I'm going to do one more check in here. I'm going to hop into the interview for Sagittarius, please. Okay, so we have a King of Pentacles, a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn here. This King of Pentacles could be low on finances. They could have lost a business or a job. This King of Pentacles causes a lot of conflict which could also give you anxiety due to the conflict that they are causing so i feel like you are going to cut this person out so this person i don't know if this king of pentacles drinks a lot or there's a lot of drinking going on in the connection or there could be other options here um but what i'm seeing is that somebody is about to stop more yeah somebody is about to stop drinking i don't know if this king of pentacles drinks a lot okay or they could have told you that you drink a lot okay but it does cause a lot of conflict here okay and i feel like someone is cutting something out for their peace because it's just causing a tower okay so there was some sort of communication here about a third party situation about multiple options or about drinking a lot here okay um there's this there's something that's causing a drift in the family dynamic okay uh, what's the energy give me more so i don't know if you help this person okay somebody is drinking too much and it's causing a lot of conflict here in a home or family dynamic okay or somebody is this is more it's the energy Yeah, so somebody has communicated with somebody that they are going to leave if something doesn't change. So somebody is trying to make a change. Okay. Yeah, so somebody somebody has communicated that if something doesn't change that they're going to be moving. Okay, there was that could have been a big fight because of this. So something's got to give here, okay? Uh, like I said, it could be due to drinking or it could be due to multiple people, but something got to give in this connection or somebody is going to walk away. Okay, somebody is going to be walking away, focusing on work. Energy. Yeah, I do feel like there's a lot of manipulation going on here with the lovers and the... Uh, so what I'm saying is that there's a lot of love in this connection, okay? Somebody could be a fire sign, a Taurus Virgo, or a Capricorn. But somebody is like, hey, something has to change when it comes to this connection or this relationship. Alright. Somebody has been in their head about this. An empress or there could be like a baby involved maybe somebody is drinking there could even be two connections here a king of pentacles and a queen of pentacles okay so like i said something has something got to give whether it is someone that is doing a lot of drinking or whether it's someone that does a lot of cheating Something has to give because someone is pregnant or someone has been a player. Someone has found something out here. Okay.
Now, I feel as though if this person doesn't change or stop doing whatever they are doing, you are going to meet somebody new. You're going to call judgment on the situation and walk away. But I do feel like you're trying to change the situation right now with someone before it gets to that point. Okay, it could be a masculine or feminine energy. Um, yeah, so you're trying to change a family dynamic or something here. Uh, because there's keep being a tower in a family dynamic or something. Someone also is being a player here. And someone knows it. And someone is just really like, I'm about to be single. What's the energy for sad? So... But somebody's still holding on to something and it is causing a tower. It's causing a lot of chaos or it's causing, it's causing, it's causing sadness, okay? Um, now, I don't know if this could be a masculine or feminine energy that you, you could be an emperor or empress dealing with a king of pentacles in reverse or a queen of pentacles in reverse. Someone that could have lost a job or low on finances here, okay, um, where you are constantly giving to this person. I don't know if this is someone in your family or someone that you are dating, but they take the money and then they go and do low vibrational things with it or they drink a lot. Okay, like I said, also somebody, somebody is just holding on to something that it just got a lot going on here. And somebody is really thinking about should they block somebody or should they give up on somebody here? Because someone is very young-minded or young or immature or very needy. Um, someone drinks a lot here. Someone, somebody has some, some sort of offer here. Okay, so you're thinking about ending something, okay, with this King of Pentacles or, or a child or somebody who you are in a family dynamic with. Um, you're not focused on, somebody doesn't care about what people say about them or somebody is not letting somebody judge them. Okay, so I just feel like whatever you got going on, Sag, I feel like you try to get control of it with the magician with this it could be a child or it can be a lover it can be a family member or whatever this is okay i feel like you're trying to get control of it because you're stressing about it or something in the home here maybe the community is talking here um about something here with the child or um there was some sort of loss of a child or a family dynamic here. Okay. Um, but like I said, you're focused on your peace, uh, your work. Okay. A lot of people are finna start getting karma here. It's a group of people finna start getting karma for doing something to you. Okay. Maybe um, you're taking a leap of faith and holding back or something like this, guys. Okay. And a lot of people are going to recover with want to recover with you because they're gonna feel like they lost you, but it might take some time for them to come back towards you or something like this. I feel like you have been very overwhelmed because you've been tied up in something toxic or someone who has toxic obsessions, mind traits, or behaviors, okay? And you just getting tired of it. You just telling this person like something gotta change with, with you or um, you know, or I got to move, but I do feel like somebody is gossiping about you. Okay, so there's a lot of gossip here from this narcissist. Maybe this, there's a lot of gossip going on about you at this time. Okay, um, or about somebody. Um, and I feel like these people who are gossiping about you are really the toxic ones, right? So you are going to cut these people off to start focusing on work or focusing on your finances or maybe even focusing on someone new because they, whoever these people is, they got a lot of toxic energy going on here. Okay, this could be a father and a child here or a father figure here that's very low vibrational and they letting this child do toxic stuff. Okay, and you just getting tired of it. Okay, you've been trying to work with this child and this narcissistic father figure here. Um, but 
I feel like it's just too much uh, toxic shit going on for you at this time. Um, so you walking away from it, okay? Maybe you that was your ultimatum in the beginning. If something doesn't change, then you're pulling your energy back. Maybe something never did change, right? Where you were unhappy or people was gossiping about you. But these people are really the ones that are toxic. There could be some sort of legal issue here. Uh, maybe a divorce, but there's definitely karma going on. These people are going to get a lot of karma for talking about you, okay? When you did nothing but wish the best for a lot of people, um, you know, maybe there was, I don't know, something you were doing financially for somebody, you were helping somebody, but it caused you a lot of emotional turmoil here. It caused your emotions to be rocky. And I just feel like mentally you're just choosing not to focus on that sort of energy right now. You are choosing to move out or take a leap of faith towards other things or other opportunities. Because you see the truth about these two people who you love or someone who you was in a dynamic family dynamic with. Or it could be somebody who is caught up with someone that they don't want to let go they're still emotionally tied to somebody you could be pregnant from this person right and they're still emotionally tied they haven't changed their ways it's causing a lot of fights amongst you and this person because you do love them or this child or this toxic father figure so there's a lot going on in your energy but you're not letting that affect you because you know within due time these people are going to try to come back here asking for your forgiveness they're going to try to come back and communicate with you about this child after you have cut this family dynamic out okay after you've accepted that something is just not changing or something is not going to change you're just going to focus on you okay but i do feel as though you have been depressed or you will be depressed okay um because you gotta cut that love back but you do see the truth about a lot of people who have betrayed you empress okay it could be an emperor or an empress okay you could be a mother this could be with a husband um this can be with somebody you were married to okay but you are moving forward uh, with the help of the divine here um, maybe it has taken some time but you are moving forward to some sort of stability some sort of peace um, even though you have been heartbroken or emotional okay all these people that hurt you or gossip about you is about to get karma these people did not change they they could have said that maybe something had to change with you but you didn't need to change something okay um it was them this whole time these narcissistic energies it could be multiple people gemini libra aquarius capricorn taurus virgo aries okay um gemini it, it could be a lot of people but now you don't want anything to do with them and they are frustrated because they are going to want to come back in all these people that gossiped about you are going to want to come back in once that karma start kicking their ass okay but if anything resonates hit that like button comment subscribe to the channel squat rose if needed and until next time bye